This is Ein. He's another port owner, and we've done a lot of business together over the years. Hi, I'm Ein. I run Port Dusty Miller out on the frontier. That armlet? You're a god eater? Yeah, I guess so. Hilda told me about you. She said you were collecting intel on Ashbourne. Here. Look at that. You've put together quite the collection here. Sorry, but it won't come cheap. I'll give you a fair price. Two billion? But that can't be right. Knock it off, man. Don't look surprised. It'll hurt us in the negotiations. Oh, man. I've never seen that many zeros. <gasps> How many candies can that buy? A whole lot. <laughs> this information will make navigating the Ashlands a hell of a lot safer. It's appropriate when you consider the cost of a failed voyage. That may be true, but why give such a good deal to complete strangers? Hilda being the one introducing you is one reason. Deals with her never go wrong. Let me think. Ah, I know. I suppose you could say that I admire your brazenness. That's all. Huh. No complaints here. We'll make updates to any existing information for free, but new information is going to cost you. Is that okay? Works for me. Sign here. So, you're the ship's ace, huh? I've heard you fight like a demon. She seems to like you. Don't let her get out of your sight, okay? I like that glint. Does this work? It sure does. We have ourselves a contract. If you want, you can wait to send the data until after you've confirmed payment. This means a lot to me, Ein. It means even more to me. Thanks for introducing such valuable new partners. Okay. Guys, we are totally loaded now! Two billion! What should we buy? Candy! Candy! This money is going toward our future. Sorry, everyone, but I hope you'll all understand. Candy! Oh, there he is. Our straight-laced Hugo. We're already fully aware, buddy. At least let us fantasize about it for a bit before we lock it away. You can be so confusing. <laughs> and buy the kids some candy, would ya? Candy! Buy the kids some! <laughs> <laughs>
instruments read normal. Go ahead and begin the operation. Time to punch in. Move out. Sweet, sweet pay. With all of your capabilities, you don't even need my support. <laughs>
First, allow me to thank all of you for answering our call. The Ashlands are expanding. At the current rate, the extinction of humanity is only a matter of time. Food, commodities, clean land. These resources are near exhaustion. We can brook no further delay. Decisive action must be taken. So as of today, we are enacting the Fenrir HQ Reclamation Initiative. Fenrir HQ disappeared. It was buried in the ash. Inside are not only vast resources, but also technologies lost in the calamity. We've set our sights on but one of them. Sleeping in a factory deep beneath Fenrir lies the final weapon against the Aragami. Odin, this god made to annihilate all Aragami, will be found and reborn to cleanse the Ashlands. We will restore humanity's lost knowledge and conquer the threat of Ash forever. Locations have been carefully Is that even possible? So that each of your caravans can Arguments were put forth defense. that Odin could have anti-ash applications. But if I recall correctly, the problem came down to securing a sufficient power source for something of that size. That kind of monster weapon's got a big belly to fill. Just like an origami. Governor General, we would like to voice a legitimate concern. Isn't that area a haven for Ash Aragami? Are you trying to send us on a suicide mission? If that is the case, I'm afraid we will have to turn you down. Damn right. Better send in some used up ages, cause we won't do it. Indeed. It is true we do not have the capacity to deal with Ash Aragami. Even a small Ashborn would have better than even odds against a full battalion. It would be fair to say that we have had no choice but to cower and shrink from their presence. Until now, that is. Now, one group has accomplished the impossible. With only a small squad, they successfully felled a large ash origami. Against an Ashborn? Impossible. No way a handful of people would be a match for one of those monsters, right? Allow me to introduce Hilda Enriquez and our heroic soldiers. I heard the Chrysanthemum has some monstrously strong ages. But aren't those just kids? Yes, but there's just something about them. Wait, could it be that's... Hey, Hugo. Everybody's staring at us. Shouldn't we wave or something? Just stand there and be quiet. These fighters from the Chrysanthemum will be the suicide corps that spearheads this operation. It is a certainty that their might will carve us a path to Fenrir HQ. Whether or not to take part in this mission is your choice. We cannot compel you. If you are unable to rise to the task, you will be pulled from the mission to avoid endangering it. That is all for now. We will be sending out the official mission guidelines later. <laughs> What's up? Sorry, it's nothing. The reclamation mission pretty much rides on our shoulders. Once we were imprisoned, and now we're at the center of the battle for humanity's future. It's a good chance to prove our worth. We don't have to wait anymore. We can move forward and take what we want. 
Nonsense. It's been your work. I never could have made it this far alone. It's thanks to you that I can fight. This will be a test of what we can really do. Let's show them all, shall we? It finally feels right. Skill will never betray you. 